Hello YouTube, Floyd Eric Rance here and this week I'm doing a text commentary video on a debate between the Amazing Atheist and Canadian Atheist on Atheism is Unstoppable. So what is a text commentary? A text commentary is basically where I will put text on basically responding to certain things TJ and Canadian Atheists say. I will probably be immature in parts of this video but let's just have a bit of fun during this. Because this took a lot of work to make at the end of it, I'll give a few quick thoughts about this whole thing. Before I start the video, however, I do want to address the inevitable question that will come up. Why did I do a text message response and not a video response? The answer is that the video that I'm responding to is 24 minutes long. And it's extremely hard to find the exact points where I would cut it and put my responses in. The resulting editing would be a complete nightmare. Not only that, but if I did do a video response and not a text response, this video would be even longer than it already is. It's already headed for a near half hour runtime overall. And a video response would put it to 40 plus minutes. So with all that out of the way, I also recommend you watch this in full screen and in a fairly high resolution as it looks good on my screen, but I don't know how good this video will come out in the video. So with all of that shit out of the way, enjoy the video and the commentary. The moments hello. How's it going? Hey, Canadian person, what's up, man? What's good? Not much. Just uh, a couple of beasts I got to bring up with you. Yeah, man. I'm, gonna, oh. I'm just really glad you're here. Hey, like, full disclosure before you bring up your beefs, I will dox you, bitch. Right, I will well, dox you this. into oblivion. Well, to dox Beware you the dox! <laughs> the dox! <laughs> Meet me at. The docks. <sighs> All right, I'm sorry. Go ahead. All right. Uh, Speak well, your firstly, mind. I'd like to say that I'm grateful that you've given me this opportunity to criticize you on this topic publicly. And yeah, I'm going to be yeah. making a lot of claims tonight. So therefore, I'm going to be supporting all these claims with evidence. <clears throat> uh, so I'll Can be I just stop you or right here? Hold like, on. Like, Didn't I see you on Google wearing like Nazi shit? Uh -oh, You're yeah, a Nazi, totally right? Fine. You're a Nazi. Is this guy in fact a Nazi? Yeah, we can I, I've, him based I've on seen, that. I've Go seen enough you. photo evidence to prove that he is definitely a Nazi. All right, you wanna, you wanna come in here and lay into uh, Devin for all the shit he's done, but I don't, dis I don't dispute anything you say about what he's done. I just don't think that him being removed from Twitter is the correct punitive measure. That's just a matter of Twitter. No, it's just a matter of personal sensibility, though. I mean, well, his account was man it was banned from Twitter. I mean, yeah, he can create yeah, a million new ones. So that doesn't matter. Removed, but he's still on Twitter. Sure, he is still on Twitter. And he always will be. Till the so, end of time. There has to be consequences for his actions. I, don't you think the consequences of his actions are his name being mud for, like, a huge number of people that are just, like, out to get him at all times, like you? Well, I no, mean, I'm he not has hounds on his he's... fucking heels, man. What, what was he doing before I started criticizing him? I don't he know. Was... Like harassing I, that's kind of the point, else. though, isn't it? I, no one knew what the fuck he was doing before you started criticizing him. Well, what, before, what before, before the, uh, the lynch uh, mobs yeah. formed, no one knew who the fuck this guy was. Before I saw that video of him uh, dissing Jacqueline Glenn, I never even heard of the motherfucker. Yeah, well, he does that same shit to everyone. He's the guy that criticizes everyone, and he believes that he shouldn't be criticized himself. So mm -hmm. I don't understand that complex where I can't criticize a narcissist that feels that he has a right to shit on everyone else. You can criticize him all you want. What the fuck did I do against your criticism? Well, no, you're just uh, deterring it. Well, not, not really deterring it, but uh, discouraging it, I assume. I'm criticizing it. You're you criticizing have, your, you have the right to criticize. I have the right to criticize your criticism. What's the problem? Yes, you do. Well, I'm just stating I should be stating facts about him. That's all I'm doing. I'm not spreading lies. I'm not spreading this information. Well, go ahead. Spread, spread the facts. Information that he's lying. Spread them. I don't give a shit. I have no problem with it. Do it. What, what it's are your you prerogative. Disputing? What? What are your criticisms of my criticism? I've made them. I've Can been making them the last couple it? days. No, you didn't miss them because you're here because you're here responding to them. What do you mean you missed them? You well, didn't miss no, them. No, your criticisms of my criticisms. Well, no. I, oh my God. What is this? In fucking Inception? All right. So, How many levels of so, so you've been know? you've been contacting me. You've been contacting you know drunken peasants, which is me. Essentially, when you, when you contact us online, uh, you've been contacting me and trying to talk to him for a while about him, uh, you know, making amends with Devin. 
Um, so you came to us. You know, I, and I don't even fully agree with TJ's position. We talked about it before the show. So I'm not necessarily on his side with this, but you came to us. So what's your problem? Yeah. Right, well, bring us your, thing, like, what's, what's uh, your issue? Quotes here. Uh, like the misinformation that you're spreading. Like I'm going to have to quote Paul here. But uh, in the hangout, uh, the sorry, your episode uh, last night, he said, uh, uh, it wasn't like he's some fucking hacker stalking through this person's trash or something. Are you aware that's the exact case that this is? He has enlisted the help of a hacker to dox his critics. <clears throat> okay. Has he broken? You know, hey, can I can I ask a question? Since that's my quote, can I ask a question for a, yes. a clarifying question? In your opinion, has Devin Tracy broken the law? Uh, yes. Why haven't the police been involved? Why is this um, all well, a little tempest? Well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why is this all a little tempest in a teapot online? If he's breaking the law in what he's doing, why haven't uh, people sued him? Why ha aren't the police involved? Why aren't there multiple cases of police involvement? I don't understand. Well, I'm, I'm um, assuming that his intimidation tactics worked on the 14-year-old that he was using them on. I'm assuming because... Uh, he's afraid of this guy. He doesn't want uh, his parents to find out that he pissed off a narcissist on the internet and he's trying to ruin his life. Okay. By releasing home addresses, phone numbers, emails. Has Devin ever is, personally, like, has Devin ever personally, like through Twitter, released somebody's uh, yes, I'll, full I'll address? I'll evidence that I have for this. Okay. Um, uh, the hacker that I'm talking about, he goes by the Twitter handle of Atheist Emu. Atheist right, and, Emu. and, 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 I showed this to them earlier. They, I mean, they're aware of that. They're aware of that individual posting docs. Situation. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. But you're aware. Okay, can I uh, read you this uh, quote <laughs> from uh, Devin Tracy? Yeah. This is verbatim. Sure. Uh, yeah. The second you cross me, the second uh, you have an ill word, the second you hit the dislike button, I will find your name and I will use my new MIT Harvard hacking genius friend and I will reveal it to the world. Uh, this then, sounds like a fucking look, look. He sounds like a fucking super villain. I mean, I know. Don't you just, I mean, like, can't you see him pulling the strings? Like every time you open your mouth, I see, I fucking see a string with Devin's hand attached to it. Oh yeah, and then they're gonna say this. Everyone's talking about me, guys. Like, don't you see Devin's that? Quote. Can't you see that? Yeah, that is his quote. Yeah. But can't you see how that quote is designed to make you have this? Oh my God! Look what Devin said. Like, don't you see well, no, he's fucking he's playing you like a cheap shit. fiddle? Don't you see that you're his bitch? Well, no, like, if you look at it, like, you guys never mentioned the home address <laughs> doxing once. Or okay. the phone number. Alright, we're, we're mentioning it now. Fine, he did the home address doxing, but the, he didn't do that. He approved yes, he of someone else. No, no, he, he approved of someone else. Someone else. No, I, shut up, I, I know the evidence, alright? So, he came to someone. Someone came to him and said, Devin, I got these skills, you want me to do this shit? And he's like, sure, do it. That's what happened. He approved of someone else doing it. He didn't himself no, do it. He was doing it under direct orders from Devin Tracy. I'll give you the he, evidence. And I, direct and, orders. And, and is I he believe, a soldier? Hold on. He I, has autonomy. I think there is he has the ability to make decisions for himself. I think there is a chance that that is against the terms of service for Twitter. You know, can tell, well, you no. know, telling, like, well, no, okay. no, I'm saying, Sorry. Sorry. why don't you shut the fuck up, dude? <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, yeah, I, I think it's against the terms of service to tell other people to do it. The holy terms. The terms of service. Hey, like, the sanctified. Given, like, given to Twitter atop Mount Sinai by the hand of God himself. Thou shalt not dox. Yes, uh. okay, but if you look at like a hitman analogy, is the person who hired the hitman responsible for the murder or not? Because they're not the one sure. who is carrying out the murder. Sure. So why Fine. is Tracy not responsible for this doxing? Yes. I, he might be responsible, he is but responsible. Is, is he responsible to Twitter? Because he's not the one who did it. And this guy was not a hitman. It was money exchanged here? Or did yeah. Devin just tell this guy, go do this? And this guy chose, with his own free will and autonomy, from, to go do it. From the evidence so, yeah, exactly. we've seen. Devin analogy. didn't have I the balls to do that himself. He made someone, someone else do chose it. to kill someone. Right. But is he not uh, liable for hiring the fucking hitman? I'm not arguing that Devin Tracy's a nice guy. I'm not well, here telling you, you he's never done anything wrong. Is he responsible for this? He's responsible. Not? He's liable. Okay, so we agree. He did so it. He's a piece of shit. It was wrong. And and I'm the, not going to go so far as to say he's a piece the, of shit. The disagreement that me and TJ have is that I don't believe that it's freedom of speech, and I don't believe that 
it should change to become freedom of speech when we're talking about a private company. And I think it's really hard to distinguish when something becomes big enough to become this free speech zone when it was originally That's you know, fine, a ben. private and you, company. That's fine, You, Ben, are consistent on that. But there's many people out there who are very selective about this TOS bullshit. There's many people out there who... When someone they like is the victim of the shitty TOS, they're like, the TOS is bullshit. But when someone they don't like is the victim of the TOS bullshit, they're like, you know what? He agreed to the TOS. Case closed. Case fucking closed. I don't like that hypocrisy. Is anyone saying that here? I don't know. Well, I've seen people are saying it at, at large. People in your camp are saying. You brought up the TOS, didn't my you, camp, tonight? I don't think anyone in my camp is saying that. Okay, I, don't, I don't speak for every one of your followers. Fine. Sure, you don't. You speak for yourself. What do you have to say for yourself? Well, I'm just addressing this bullshit that he Go does ahead. all the time. Like, Fine, he does that, bullshit. Uh, like Are, we're, not, we're, we're not in disagreement, Can so I, what's the point? Well, the fact that you're promoting this asshole. I'm promoting him? You're well, promoting him just as much as I am. You're promoting him just as much as I am. I'm criticizing him. That's different. You're criticized. Don't. Yeah. You're, I mean, we, we have criticized. I him. criticize Brett Keen. I know I'm giving him promotion in the process. Did you put I know Brett I'm Keen helping on your him out. Channels list? No, I don't have Brett Keen on my featured channels list. That's more as a slight to Jacqueline Glenn, who fucking removed me from her shit. Because I knew that you that would be the person Jacqueline. that would piss her off most. I do, obviously. God, okay. look at this. We're discussing the minutia of who's on whose fucking recommended channels list. I feel like I'm in a uh, like one of the fucking uh, the, that Star Trek episode, the Drumhead. This is like a Drumhead trial you guys are having <laughs> of this fucking guy. You guys are the internet police, and you're like Devin Tracy done did wrong, and we gonna make sure he pay. But well, don't you were but don't, in our camp four months ago, were you not? I was in your camp when it was a war of words, but now that it's become a war of doxing and of um, getting people's accounts taken down and all this uh, uh, no, extracurricular okay, this bullshit. Uh, we do not dox their side at all. We don't. No, I was talking dox. about him there. I was talking about him. Yeah, well, I mean, it's not a war if we're not participating in it. You are that's participating. In it. You got his account taken Just, down. You flagged his account down. That's, that's not doxing. And that's that's uh, not doxing. I didn't say it was doxing. I was saying that I was talking about doxing, comma. Getting his account, T people's accounts taken. I mean, down. TJ saw Two this. separate things. TJ mentioned. Think of them with bullet points next to them, so you can understand the separateness. TJ mentioned that this was going to happen to me like a few weeks ago, actually, because he saw the doxing thing starting. Mm -hmm. So you know, it's only logical that that would happen next. So I, of course, I saw it was that. inevitable. I've been on the internet long enough to know exactly how right. this shit's going to play this, out. This is atheism is unstoppable. Dude, the for, second I made my video for, on my TJ does life channel, I I could have predicted my fucking self getting sucked into all this bullshit but, but the thing is i don't want to be involved in this bullshit i don't want to be involved in this petty stupid youtube drama with devin tracy versus whoever the fuck i don't give a shit about any of it involved? i got involved because it i was the fucking catalyst for this shit no, more recently, than anyone like else you, said you didn't want to be involved and then you started promoting skullduggery and aiu because they, they've been very nice people, and I've had some nice conversations with them and gotten to know their point of view instead of fucking flagging them into oblivion. Well, are you sure that's not lies? Because their point of view involves flagging into oblivion. Like, do you know of what course a true it campaign is? But you, I'm, you know, that part of them is reprehensible, but don't you see that you're allowing him to drag you down to his level Are you the fucking mudslinger too? Yeah, I'm are aware of it. I'm willing to step up and face him. I'm doing what he does to everyone else to him. Are you I'm the bearded? The in the sandbox and I'm rubbing his face I, I'm sorry, but I just view that as hypocrisy. Okay, are you so the bearded how, hipster how arbiter? Hold, hold on one second. Oh, give me one second. Are you the bearded hipster arbiter of TJ's uh, ability to discern lies from people? Like, what is this even about? Like, TJ had a conversation with the guys. He liked the conversation. <laughs> is that not? Is this guy just the total black heart villain to you? Well, no, like, you're clearly being misled on a lot of things, because there was not a false flag campaign. It was one flag uh, about he doxed a friend of mine, Uzalu, who uh, mm -hmm. would have wanted to come on the show also. But uh, he doxed his full name and his location, and he reported that once to Twitter, and Twitter removed his account. Devin Tracy made up another account. He did the same thing. He uh, reported him again. He lost his account again. He made another account, and that got banned. Uh, so then now he's on his... Uh, Tracy that's fine. Reed. I mean, look, if, 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 that's, if that's how it went down, that's fine. But I still don't think that Twitter's reaction should have been to remove the account. So where did you get the information of this uh, false flag or of this false flag campaign? 
I never said false flag campaign. Yes, did I did. ever say the words false flag campaign? Yes, you did. Uh, like at least twice in your video. All right, fine. Well, I rescind the false flag campaign thing. If indeed no, you you're giving me an accurate summary of where Devin it goes Tracy. out. No, I, I haven't even talked. I have not even talked to Devin Tracy in since your started secret going down. meetings with AIU. The Legion yeah. of the last, Evil. Me, the last time I talked to Devin Tracy was like three or four weeks ago. Shut up, AIU mouthpiece. TJ, TJ, excuse me. Have you been associating with one like, known is he dude, like, you, Devin you, Tracy? Wait, in your mind, is he like worm tongue <laughs> whispering in my ear like, say this, TJ? It's ridiculous. There was yeah, a false no, flag. I was to think of making that meme. Honestly, I was. The, a mem? Mem? Okay. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Fuck Canada. Nuke Canada. Yes, hashtag Nuke Canada. A mem. <laughs> Fuck me. No. <laughs> All right, uh, could I bring up another point? Sure, but please. Yeah, bring it on up. All right, hey, uh, do, you, do you watch American news? <laughs> no, I don't, honestly. Okay, okay. Good. There's a video of him going, I don't watch American news. If, if, if someone in the chat said Devin is my boyfriend, why don't you fucking Photoshop some pictures of us uh, holding hands? Yeah, TJ, so needs, happy TJ needs more fat material. Yeah, man. Please do. I want to jerk off. Sk skip you hand in hand with AIU. Fact, I, want, I want a fucking, I'm going to put up a new fucking photo challenge. Right AIU is going to fist TJ. $100 to the best picture of me and Devin Tracy in a romantic situation together. Fucking A. Can I, can I, b b before? <laughs> oh uh, One. Hundred fucking dollars! Wow. wow, damn! Hey, what what did you say to that? What did you say to that guy at uh, on the tube station in London? Tweet them to me. Tweet them to me. What did you say to That's the guy? Bald is a beautiful. TV. Yeah, at amazing atheist. Bald is beautiful. Okay, but before we move on uh, to another point from Canadian atheist, can I ask him one thing? Like just a quick thing. Do it. All right. Uh, do you know that there is a way for you and the people like? Because I, I assume what you want is for Devin to stop doing what he's doing, right? You want him to stop doxing. Yes, you want nice. him to stop being poisonous, toxic person, right? On online, you want mm -hmm. that over, right? You want to know how to end it? Oh. Stop talking about him. Let him languish in relative obscurity with only his little rabid followers yeah, I mean, to no. echo Hold his on. fucking opinion Hold back on. at him. Hold if if enough know. people, you no, know, listen to me. If enough people did this, guess I'm what? Make a There's point, nobody Paul. left to dock. Paul, uh, uh, TJ um, no. started. Hold on, hold on. TJ started ig ignoring Devin, and eventually, what happened was he would just start getting random tweets from Devin, like "fuck you, micro dick." I mean, like <laughs> if you ignore him, he'll try to get you to pay attention to him. Again. Yeah, sure. I should have just, I mean, just blocked his ass. Drama, but he also has a really progressive channel. If you actually just look at the statistics and the analytics behind his channel, he grows progressively. So ignoring the problem will only grow. It's like, oh, well. But his channels get taken right? down just as much as his Twitter accounts. I Talk mean, he's on the fourth one now. I mean, he's back on his original, yeah, but he's, he's bouncing original. between yeah, channels for fuck's sake. He's going to grow, Talk so I should just not worry about him because he's going to get himself banned. With no one criticizing No, him. I'm just saying, like, what is he, what is he going to, I mean, like, what is he doing that this needs your attention? Like, why is he well, so important to you? fucking images. How about him putting swastikas but on people? That was because critics. you started fucking fucking with him. So I learned I a long time ago. Him, therefore, it gives him the right to slander me. It doesn't give him the right, but that's just how he is. Like, have you okay, ever heard? So if, don't you know the world has assholes him. in it? I'm saying What's if that? you're gonna criticize, no, I'm saying if you're gonna criticize him, you have to understand he plays dirty. Yeah, it's like you wouldn't go up to a big I'm steroidal like, fucking mongoloid on the street and be like, "Fuck you, buddy." Yeah, and you know I'm you're saying, gonna get punched in the face. This big a piece of shit who will dox his critics and do this kind of shit to his critics. That's mm -hmm. worth noting. That's worth talking about. Or is that worth ignoring? <laughs> it is worth ignoring. Who gives a shit? It's not like he's the biggest fucking person on YouTube or some shit. You guys have placed like Devin Tracy. You guys have placed Devin Tracy on this pedestal. His critics are the people that are making him the. You're putting AdSense money right in his pocket right now. And you've made uh, him into this like no. Machiavellian yes, yes. supervillain, dude. Yes. You've he's made like, him you're into on a the... supervillain. He's got agents. He's got a fucking army, and he can order people to do things. He's like a general in your mind. He's like fucking Zod. <laughs> Kneel before Zod, son of Jerusalem. Kneel before Devon. Black. All right, can I bring up my point? Yeah. Go bring ahead. It bring it on up. All right. Uh, in your uh, AIU and freedom of speech video. Uh, I can't think of a single I've learned a lot more censored. shit since then, so I'm just gonna. But you go ahead. 
I'm just saying I've 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 read I've been more information has come I've to been light. more informed. I wouldn't have made that video what I know now. That was you <laughs> okay, know, but so whatever. Just would, so. How would you describe AIU now? Would you? Have how said would I describe him? I mean, I I still would have stick by some essential things, but the, some things would have been worded and argued differently. But go ahead, bring your, bring up your point. All right, uh, you said, I can't think of a single person he has censored because when Devin Tracy doesn't like what you have to say, he blocks you from his Twitter, and that's what he does. He will simply block you. And then you go on to say, uh, this is not Brett Keen we're dealing with. This is not a stupid, unreasonable man. Uh, this is a guy that can be talked to, can be approached, can be reasoned with, uh, sure. but no one wants to do that. No one wants to actually have a conversation. Yes. All right, can you make a statement on that? Uh, I would stand by that. How? What? Yeah. What's your criticism of his statement? Are you just going to sit there and look at him, or are you going to like... Are you uh, are you utterly dumbfounded by his answer? Yeah, that that I, Devin I Tracy am. might Devin Tracy might not be this pure black, snidely whiplash, mustache well, twirling no, like villain that you guys make him out to be. That he might that there statement. might be he might just be an asshole most of the time, and maybe there's a reasonable person in there that can be talked to if you take time away from the fucking megaphone for 15 seconds. Going, he's doxing, ban him. He violated the fucking TOS. Maybe if you talk to no, the guy, no, he's also on pedestal doing that to everyone else, and you're saying we should. Mm -hmm. That's the way he. He is. Well, he's an asshole. What do you want? Standard. Well, he's an it's asshole. All right. Why is it double standard? Because you're okay. This guy is on a box shouting at everyone, calling for mm -hmm. true flags, calling for true doxing. And then you're uh -huh. saying, oh, I'm supposed to politely uh, go up to him, kiss his ass, and present my argument. No. Well, he's you know kiss his ass. everyone, fat shaming, and doing everything else. There's, There's so many things you could do. You can do whatever you want. Listen, you can do whatever you want. You can go criticize him. You can do whatever you want I to am? do. I'm not, I don't have any problem with the way you're conducting yourself. Do what you want. I'm just saying I'm not, I'm not with you. That's all I'm saying to you. You go be you. You think that you're doing the best appropriate thing. This is the best way to deal with him. Fine. I don't think he's that important. I don't think I, I think he's playing you. I think all of this stuff he says is designed to be incendiary. He knows exactly what he's doing. Absolutely. He knows exactly what the reaction he's going to get is going to be. Yep. And if you're just playing into his hand. <laughs> You're, you're oh my god! That would be his intention to get his channels banned. Yeah. He doesn't give a fuck about his channels. He doesn't give a fuck about his channels or his Twitter or any of that. Atheism he is. He cares about his name. He cares about people knowing atheism is unstoppable. What he's about. What he's doing. That's you know, what he cares how, about. How does that work when those accounts are being deleted? That makes no sense. Atheism is unstoppable. Is he gone? Or... Let me ask you a question. Is he gone from YouTube? Is he not around? Does no one know who he is anymore? Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, no, are, okay, are we not sitting here format. talking about him for 30 minutes? On a very popular YouTube uh, fucking show, by the way. Yeah. Look at the fucking attention he's getting. Do you really think he's being hurt by right? this? And like, honestly, we wouldn't even be talking well, about this if you didn't want to come on. on here. Let me tell you. Let me tell you a little fucking story. There's a fucking, uh, you, you know the show Married with Children? You ever heard of that? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's an old show. You know, uh, I don't watch yeah. American TV. His show, the, the show was, it, it's early seasons, his ratings are in the fucking toilet, okay? No one gives oh, yeah. a fuck about this show. It's gonna be canceled. It's on the verge of cancellation. Guess what happens? Some Christian parent group fucking hears some joke in the show that they take offense to, and they make a big fucking stink, like, this is the worst, most immoral, disgusting show on television. You know what happens? More people watch it. They're curious. They want to see what this offensive show is like. Eight seasons later. Yeah, it lasted eight seasons. It was on the verge of cancellation. The critics only helped it. I think that's what you're doing. All right, so we're, we're going to move on soon. Is there anything else you want to say? Yeah, uh, you got any final words? We'll give you the last thoughts on this shit. Uh, just looking at my quotes here. Uh, well, I guess it's again. Uh, so you've backtracked on that's him uh, being censored, being uh, having his YouTube or sorry his Twitter account being removed. That's not censorship. Do you agree to that? Who? What happened? Like uh, you were saying it, that AIU is being censored and that that's a freedom of speech issue, which I I'm trying to demonstrate that it's not. Would you um, see to that? It's a freedom of speech issue on a not in a legal sense of freedom of speech, uh, and he's not even in fact a U.S. citizen, so he's not even under the protection of that anyway. Um, but uh, in an interpersonal sociability uh, sense of freedom of speech, in that I'm going to 
try my best to protect the freedom of speech of those around me, and they're going to do the same, and they're not going to uh, try to uh, take uh, extra verbal means against me. Or my yeah, opinions. but you're also protecting the freedom of speech of the guy who's trying to take away freedom of speech. Like my argument. Yeah, like, uh, I would. But, I mean, look, if, it, but that's that's the that's the paradox of freedom of speech. If someone stand if someone stands up in the town square and says freedom of speech should be abolished, what do you do? Censor them? No, of course not. You've got to no, give them freedom of freedom speech. Freedom of speech should be abolished, and then goes and does a bunch of dishonest shit. I'm gonna say, look at this guy doing dishonest shit. Also, and say it. And that's what I don't care. Banned. That's that's your right. I don't I don't deny you that. Go ahead. Just don't deny your role in his continued popularity. You need to really take well, a look at I your role. If you hadn't come on this show tonight, there wouldn't be 30 minutes of Devin Tracy on the right. Big Cousins podcast. Yeah, we weren't going to cover that. Uh, well, yeah. Got 12 minutes of TJ Does Life, so. Okay. Not yeah. And, and, and how and many I, minutes of your fucking life? I have my criticisms of that video, and I think, like, you know. No, Ben probably agrees with uh, you more than me. But anyway, uh, that's enough of this shit. Thank you for coming on. Um, best of luck with your uh, Devon hunting. Thank you. So, what do I think of this whole debate? Defeat atheism is unstoppable in the realm of ideas, Canadian atheist. Don't resort to flagging his channels in his Twitter account. The same goes for everyone else fighting against AIU. The doxing and false flagging of channels is something he does. And his fans do it as well. And again, for the umpteenth time in this video, Canadian Atheist, your stooping down to atheism is unstoppable's level. And he is far more experienced at doing this sort of shit, this sort of bullshit, than you or most of the other people involved in this campaign are. That means he's going to beat you. Just pure experience, he's going to beat you. But just because I'm criticizing Canadian Atheist about that, doesn't mean I totally agree with TJ. Quite the contrary, I think the TJ is wrong to say that this is a free speech issue. Normally, if it was nearly anybody else, I would say yes, it may be a freedom of speech issue. But in the cases of atheism is unstoppable, I'd say it probably apply, this applies to Brett Keane, Jenny McDermott and Tommy Sotomayor. Main, they're the main four that come to mind. They just do the same thing. They have this one major thing in common. You take down one Twitter account, they make another. You take down one of their YouTube channels. Not only do they have backup accounts in all cases, but they'll make new accounts to make up for lost channels. Atheism is Unstoppable. He recently did this. He created a channel called Atheism is Unstoppable Archives. He's now posted a lot of videos there. So he's now got four videos again. It's the same with Jenny. After she lost Pee Wee Burger 1, she's now made Anita Watson. I know this because she's actually subscribed to me. Along with, for some reason, Bewildered Ape. It's weird, honestly. But I digress. I haven't seen the video that TJ did on Atheism is Unstoppable on the TJ Does Life channel. Uh, with my busy uni schedule, I'm going to have to try and find some time to do that. Uh, so when I do, I'll might amend that video, this video, in annotations after I post this video and after I watch that one. So that was my video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please rate, comment, share and subscribe and have a great day everyone.